Alright, is that three? Oh my god, that's three levels down. We're like half an hour into the stream and we're already done with the second to last world. Of stream two, I, sh I should preface that saying this is the second stream. So it, it has been two and a half hours, but like still, three hours in on world... Ow. Yeah, yeah. Here and go. There is an achievement for beating the 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 entire game in two hours, I think. So like very possible. I've somehow missed every enemy in that section. Oh god. This is a bad realize it time to realize that I don't remember where the secrets are in this level. Uh have a good one, Wim. See ya. Kill it's naughty, I did. Yes. I told you, I did it by accident! I, like, ran because I forgot he was there, and then I bumped into him, and then because he's, he's like, super fragile, he went dead. I don't even think I remembered him existing in my first playthrough, because I just killed him, and then I came back, like, a week later. Uh, I think I'll be good, probably. Like... The stream is going to be long enough that I'll have enough time to, like, comb through the level more slowly if I do miss something. I know one of these is in the escape, because I think usually, but not always, because you can never count on it. One of them is, like, off a cliff somewhere. I remember that, because I was like, what the fuck? Why is this up here? Anyway, these, uh, these blue blocks, you cannot break. You, you need the fire to break them. Also, this fire is not very, it's very janky. <laughs> I, I think I'm good, little man. Well, uh, I've screwed this up forever. Wait, maybe not. Saved. <laughs> yeah, this level's very confusing on your first run through, because you're like, I see something here, but I can't get it yet. Yeah, and that's the third secret right there. Like this? Yes. Okay. I can't. It's a bit sad they don't teach you like all the maneuvers in this game. God damn it! Uh, no, no, right. I gotta uh, super, super jump here. There's secret one, which you get by unthawing the level. The level is unthawed. Which is this level's gimmick. Okay, so I... Oh, god damn it. This level is fun. This, this secret is fun, because it's enemy bouncing. My favorite. What picture shows in my profile? Uh, I'm... Gonna assume that it's Pepino Pizza 2. Okay, I think it's in this room. There's like a, a cliff somewhere where the second secret is. Level? it is. I think it's like after a checkpoint or something. I don't know. Okay, maybe it's not this room. Something dealt with my name is Little Man. Uh, I don't know. This could be this room. Wait, I need. Right, a video game about speed. Go fast. <laughs> I am very glad that I know about the, the shoulder dash, because that is a very satisfying thing to do. It, like, it feels like a, uh, a shine spark. It feels good. Uh, don't worry about it. Three, 
bod the level and hit a wall because I'm good at this. <laughs> Oh, right, uh, Santa. This level is very easy to get a high combo in. You, you can, in fact, kill the Santa. I don't know if it's beneficial to do so, but you definitely can. Damn it, you know? <laughs> Uh, you cannot, by the way, farm the, um, the Santa farm spawned enemies do not count towards your combo. Like, they, they, they increase it, I think. Oh, okay. this room? Look, I'm, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna be completely honest. I do not remember. <laughs> God, momentum. <laughs> In a momentum-based momentum platformer, it's more likely than you think. God, that killed my momentum. <laughs> off of here? I just remember jumping off a cliff somewhere in, in I think, this room. Ah, right here, I think. Yeah! Falling break the combo. Oh god. Ugh. No! The tomato! Well, it's fine. We don't need we don't need that tomato anyway. We'll just make tomatoless pizza. Which is unfortunately something that I've had. Hello, bot. You go. Oh wait, you want to do it, Kairu? You you can have this one. Yeah, I gotta like. I think my highest combo in my other playthrough is in this. but I'm apparently not on my A-game. Hydrate, thank you for the reminder. Bot was captured. As they deserve to be. And now for the real gimmick of this level that makes the what which is why getting the combo for this level is hard. What Pina, why are you choking? And that's it. You are invincible for the entire second half of the level. And also you can fly. <laughs> Gerald is. We might be coming back to this one for the treasure. I don't remember where the... the... You hydrate? I did indeed. I took a, a sip of my... I don't have a water bottle on me, but I, I took a sip of my water. God damn Santa. You cannot burn... You cannot burn the Santa, unfortunately. Fireproof. I, I don't know why he's fireproof, but I guess Santa prepares for everything. As you must, I suppose, if you want to travel the world in like. How many hours is a night? Like, considering that, like, he travels across all kinds of time zones. Like, he obviously doesn't go for. T oh, bye. We need the Santa, Santa, Santa. Sure. I'm 
I'm really hopeful that I didn't miss Gerald. I'm, I mean, it's, it's fine. We have the time. It's okay. Get bopped. Whatever you are. Oh, well, there's John Gutter. So, that's not a great sign. I also have to remember to keep a lookout for the... Oh, uh, well, th there he is. <laughs> that was not hard. He was just sent out for the occasion. He... He came prepared. I don't know why he came prepared, but he sure did. But yeah, this section of the level is, like, comically easy to get high combos on. <laughs> why was I calling him Gerald? <laughs> I don't actually particularly care about combo for this run through because I'm just trying to get everything in the level right now. This video. I mean, sure. Also, I love the touch that that uh. Frozen. Um, brain, please. Did I? Fine, I can always go back if I miss the secret. I think it's in here, actually. Yes, okay, it is. Ah! <laughs> I forgot the game expects you to be able to fly here. Okay, somewhere in here is going to be the door, I think. Not, maybe not here necessarily, but there you are. It's an ice cream sandwich. And I, <laughs> I remember ice cream sandwiches. Although they're <laughs> the the cookie, like the the cookie, whatever it is, the pastry. The chocolate part is always like super sticky and gets on all over your fingers. I do apologize, little man. I am mostly a gaming channel. I don't do reactions. I'm, I'm probably just gonna keep playing the video game. Especially since I haven't watched it before and don't know, like, what's in it. Anyway, we, 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 oh wait, boss fight was literally right next to me. What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> Alright, it's time for... This boss fight's great. Watch if we have time. I, I, I'll probably watch it after stream. This, this boss is... Oh, god damn it! I, I hecked that up. I was gonna say this boss is easy, but then I ruined it. 
I this might be my favorite boss. Like the the actual phase teaches you patterns and then the phase second phase is just oh my god. Don't worry about how his health bar hats are dripping. I'm sure that means nothing. <laughs> What's cool about this phase is that I don't actually have to pay attention because I can see movement off the corner of my eye. Oh God, this is, I think probably one of the harder attacks to dodge, although apparently you can do it perfectly by moving left and right. He says, moments before getting hit. That's, a, that's another hard pattern. But yeah, this, this fight's very satisfying. <laughs> although sometimes that, that pattern makes, you hard, <laughs> makes it hard. <laughs> I always mistime that. This fight is, is mostly pretty easy until the guy that throws his head at you get, shows up. This fight is really not that hard. But it, it just feels so good. God. I forgot about the running guys. <laughs> and phase two is just phase one again, except now there's other ads that I'm, I mean... I took way more damage than I needed to. I took damage in phase one, which is like the easiest phase. This is where things get difficult for me. Because you have to both be in a position to avoid the boss and then also avoid the overhead slime. God damn it. I was there! That's basically how the game always works. Is phase two is just a slightly more complicated than phase one. <laughs> this is the easy phase, binary. What are you doing? I think I'm just waiting for him, for him to get vulnerable, which like, he's always vulnerable. I mean, he's always vulnerable when he's running. I also love how they remix It's Pizza Time for this. Yeah, good boss fight. Very, very nice. Though, to be honest, every boss fight in this game is a good boss fight. They're all so good. I, I don't know the pat I don't know the line for dodging this attack. I suppose I should probably be using my run button somehow. That was risky. I don't know why I did it. Yeah, no, that was coming. That, what? Come on!
All right, that's the taunt, obviously, because like all of his move set is like based off your Pino's move set, obviously. I think two guys run at you. Yeah, that's the other guy. This is a bit like a bullet hell. You want to watch yourself. Avoid the walls in this section, I think. Because, god damn it. I find it's so. I, I can't. I'm bad at like focusing on both things. That piece is an easy one. You just gotta run for the cosmic horror pizza monster thing. Let's go. You are, this section is surprisingly lenient, but you will want to be fast anyway. I assume if you fail this, you lose immediately, but I don't actually know because I, I haven't been caught by him before. Again, very lenient, all things considered. horror phase. I do- I always say this game has slight horror inspirations. And it's like, very obvious at this end last world. Okay, campers, rise and shine! Bruno's Pizza! I don't know who Bruno's it, Bruno is, but I don't like what happened to him. Also, we don't talk about him. I'm surprised that was worth a B. Expecting the bosses is going to be fun. And yet, also, since those might be the easiest, because they're, like, not speedrun-oriented. They're just about learning the boss. We don't talk about Bruno. That song is really good. 